Hey guys, Mad Tech here. Welcome back to another video. Sorry if my voice is a little low. It's uh, kind of late at night, so I'm kind of keeping my voice a little bit low. But uh, in this episode of The Crooked Man Part 10, I'm not even going to spoil anything. You just got to watch. That's all I'm going to say. You just got to watch. Let's just say things really, 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 really got interesting. So, Again, thank you guys so much for all the support. We are really close to 200 subscribers, and I will say this till the day I die. I thought I wasn't going to pass 10. So the fact that we are so close to 200 is amazing. Thank you guys so much. But like I said, thank you guys, and have a great day. All right, let's get back into this. Come on, Fluffy. Let's go. How do we get into Ah, there we go. Okay, so we need... So I have these letters. Hint paper, please. Give me a call. Okay, so we found the flowers. We haven't found wash your hands. We found the lunch. We did the nurses. We did the sky. Give me a call and wash your hands. Okay. So where would a phone be? Where would a phone be? Where was that it? Ah, yes. A public phone. Nice. And then wash your hands. Oh, wait. Bathroom. I'm really thirsty. Can I have a drink? No way. This water's no good. Wait, is this not it? Okay. Well, it's in one of these bathrooms. Hey, there's something over there. Huh? Hey, you're right. Something's stuck in the drain. Got an A piece. Let's go! Mr. David, I gotta go pee. Huh? Oh, okay. I guess this is the girls' room. So you shouldn't technically... So you should technically go to the boys' one. Not sure if it'll flush, though. I, I It's okay. I don't think the freaking janitor's gonna come back for the hospital and come clean up his little mess. Okay. I'll wait here. You can go by yourself, right? Yeah, I'll be good. All right. <clears throat> hey, Fluffy, you okay in there? I'm peeing, hold on. All right. What's that? Huh? What is it, Fluffy? Come out already. Ah, shoot. No, I can't open the door. What? Oh, no. Oh, shoot. Don't freaking, like, slam. It really won't open. Did the door just break or what? No, Fluffy, no. Mr. David, I can't get out. Am I going to be stuck here forever? It's okay, Fluffy. I'll get you out right away. Just give me a second. Ah, oh, shoot, 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 shoot. Can I, is there a way to get in through here? The wall is slightly damaged. There are fragments. Hey, maybe if I break this wall some more, do I have anything I can use? Uh, Lighter, bloody key. Just a bunch of scraps. Oh, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. There's a hammer, there's a hammer, there's a hammer, there's a hammer. Where's the hammer? Where's the hammer? Where's the hammer? Where's the hammer? Ah, yes, the hammer. Give me the hammer. I bet I can break that wall with this. Probably. Let's go. Oh, Fluffy. Oh, Fluffy. Fluffy. Oh, shoot. Fluffy. Yeet. This wall is slightly broken. Where's the hammer? Where's the hammer? Where's the hammer? There's the hammer. There we go. Fluffy, get away from the wall. I'm going to break through it. Like Hulk. Fluffy? 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 Hey, what's wrong? What happened? No! No! Don't come near me! I'm scared! Fluffy, it's okay. Gosh dang it, Fun! Shush! It's me, David. Who is text- Why does everyone text me in the middle of a freaking video? I swear. Mr. David? Wait! Be a big boy, Fluff Fluff. Fluffy, are you okay? Are you hurt? Seriously, what happened? Uh, 
I was waiting for you, Mr. David. And then I turned around and there was a guy there and he tried to get me. A man? Fluffy, what, what was he like? His neck was all limp and he was grinning. He looked at me and said, found you. I was so scared I hid in here. A man with a crooked neck? It's him. So he followed me here too. Dang it. Why Fluffy and not me? I don't know. Have you met this guy? He's a creep. Of course he'd freaking want to go after a child. I was scared. I was so scared. It's okay now, Fluffy. You did good for yourself. I'm proud of you. If he's here, then I can't let Fluffy stay here. I'll have to take him to the police. I'm pretty sure he's not going to enjoy that. Fluffy, shouldn't we go to Mr. Policeman? It's dark and dangerous around here. I'll take you there. It'll be okay. No! I'm staying with Mr. David. I'm waiting for Mama. Fluffy, please, don't be selfish. He's not being selfish. He, he's scared, all right, David? I'm sure your Mama went to the police, too, so... No! Mom said wait here, so I know she's going to come find me. And I'll wait here, because I'm tough and buff. Fluffy. If I can't find him here soon, and if Fluffy's mom doesn't show, then I'll have to take him to the sheriff. Fluffy sure won't like that, though. Boy, this is getting really, really troublesome. I hope she just shows up soon. All right, Fluffy. We'll wait together a little longer, okay? Your mama will come soon. I know it. So, hey, don't cry. You're a big boy, right? Don't tell mama that I cry. Mama hates when I cry. She gets mad. I won't tell a soul. That's a promise between men. Now let's go. Okay. I hope everyone enjoyed my voice acting there. Not great, because... It's Mmm. Someone's having a good lunch. What's that sound? I think it's on this floor. Oh, it is on this floor? Well, I don't know. Ah. Hello. Are you enjoying your lunch? What is he doing? I don't know. Mmm. Is it, is it eating the embryo model? Why would you get close to it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Mr. David! Oh, hi. No, no, stay away! <laughs> Fluffy. <sighs> I gotta chase that monster. Oh, oh my head, I'm bleeding. I'm so dizzy. Alright, well, let's freaking keep moving, I guess. Freaking messed you up. Are they not here? Where are they? Would they go to the top? Let's go check the top first, since there's only one floor up top. Let's check. Are they up here? Ah, yes, fluffy. <laughs> No, I don't want to stay away. Stay away. I have to do something about that thing. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where the fart, where the fart, where the fart. I don't know what to do. Okay. <laughs> he just turned around and just like, the heck are you doing? I'm trying to eat my lunch here. He just slapped me. Gosh dang it. I don't know what to do. I don't have any weapons. Okay, let's think about this logically before I go up and get slapped up by the Crooked Man again. So, I don't have any items on me, and usually with these, like, for the past two scenes, or two places we've been to, every time we've encountered the Crooked Man, we have to click something that's in that area. The problem is we're not in a room, so it's gotta be in that hallway. So there's gotta be something that I can grab. Okay. Did I not save? I didn't save. Bart! Oh, I didn't fucking say. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Alright, I'll be back once again. I don't know why I keep doing this crap. Alright guys, I'm finally back. I don't know why I always forget to freaking save in this game. 
Don't know what it is. Okay. So like I was saying, we don't have any items because if you look, yeah, we can't, we don't have like anything. Nope, we have nothing. So let me look around real quick. There is a fire extinguisher here. I wonder if that does anything. But... All right. Fluffy. Hey, I already said this part. All right. It's not this. It's this. I'll use this against the monster. Ah, it is this. Look at that. Smack. Get away from Fluffy! Yeah, get back. Mr. David. Fluffy, you're not hurt. Nope, I'm fine. I'm sorry, Mr. David. It, it was my fault that you, uh, you got hurt, Mr. David. It's okay. Not your fault. Didn't do anything wrong. Mr. David! No! Okay. It's not your fault. Don't be distraught. Maybe I shouldn't say this, but this kind of thing happens all the time. If we had noticed a little sooner... What is that talking about? Is that talking about like the mom, his mom or whatever? That's the only thing I would think of it comes to mind. Cause the mom's in the hospital with whatever she has. I don't even remember what she had, but she has something. Mr. David. Did I pass out? Head still hurts, stupid monster. Mr. David, are you really okay? Yeah, Fluffy, I'm fine. You're not hurt? Nope. I'll be fine too. Sorry for worrying you. Looks like that monster went away. Fluffy. I want my mama. I don't like monsters. I don't like the dark. Fluffy. Should we go to the police? I'm sure your mother's there, so... I, I told mama I'd wait... Mama said she'd be proud of me, so I'll, I'll wait for her. Mama wouldn't lie. She's going. She's going to come come for me, so I have to wait here. He really should be with the sheriff, but he just won't listen. And if I try to force him, he'll just run. I'll give it a, a little more time, then I'll force him to go if I have to. I do wonder what his mom's doing, though. Leaving her son behind like this. I can't believe some people. And what's that monster up to? He was chasing me before, but now he's just after Fluffy. I don't think I can possibly know. I just need to protect him from being attacked. Maybe I should find a weapon somewhere. You're a good kid, Fluffy. Playing up with all this, you're really great. I bet your mom is really glad. Hold out a little more, okay? I'll stay with you. No more monsters? I can't say, but I'll protect you if there are. So don't wander away from me, okay? Okay, I'll stay with you, mister. Okay. Let's go, Fluffy. So now that we have all the pieces, uh, I have to remember where the room is. I don't think it's these. No. It's one of these rooms. Aha, yes, 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 yes. Okay. So I, I'm guessing it's family, because F-A, there's an M here. Okay, and then I, and then I saw an L, and then a Y. Family. Got the safe key. What's in the safe? Unlock the safe. Got a revolver. Ooh, got a got some pistol ammo. Okay. Well, now what? No, oh, shoot. No. You stay back from Fluffy. Fluffy, no. 
monster! Mr. David, help! This monster is persi persistent. Fluffy, over here! No, I'm scared of monsters. I don't wanna, I don't wanna! Fluffy, get over here. Don't let that monster come near you. Wow! Fluffy! I gotta go after Fluffy. Where would he go? Where would he go? Where would he go? He wouldn't go downstairs. Down here. Is he down here? Is he down here? Where would he go? Where, where, where's the one place he would go? Where's the one area? If he can't get out, then he would go up. He had to have gone to the roof, right? Part of me thinks he went to the roof. Right, we're gonna go check the roof. If not, he's in one of the rooms. He's gotta be, he's gotta be. There he is, yep, Fluffy. Oh, shoot. David, shoot him now! No, 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 no! Stay away! Mr. David, help! Get over here, Fluffy. Don't let it get near you. Ah, oh, run away, Mr. David. Help! Dang it! It really is after Fluffy. Why? Fluffy, listen. Don't let it catch you. Run away. I'll take care of it. Okay. Oh, shoot. Oh, boy. Fluffy, 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 Fluffy. Fluffy, get... Okay. I just shot the kid. Okay. Well... Fluffy! I shot the child. I didn't mean to shoot the child. Okay, that's fine. Whatever. Fucking Fluffy. Fluffy, listen. Fluffy, stop getting in front of him. Fluffy! God dang it, Fluffy! Fluffy, stop running in front of him when I'm trying to kill him. Fluffy, Fluffy, Fluffy. Fluffy, stop it. Ah, shoot. Look at this ugly looking thing. Fluffy, I'm gonna slap you up. Fluffy, stop running in front of me when I'm trying to kill him. Just run away. This is gonna suck. Oh, shoot. No, I'm gonna wait. 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 Gosh, Fluffy, you are so dumb. Stop it, Fluff. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay. Die already. Let's go. Get out. Freaking kick his crooked. This is the end. Don't come near Fluffy again, monster! <laughs> Holy crap, he freaking yeeted him! Whew. I don't know how many times I shot it. But not even it could survive that. I don't know, you've pushed it- what- what have you done? You smacked it with an- a, like a fire extinguisher, you've pushed it down a hole, you've set it on fire, you've locked it in a room, I'm pretty sure this thing is still alive, most likely. This thing isn't human. Fluffy, I'm sorry you had to go through that, but it's okay now. Yeah, are you okay? I shot you three times because you were an idiot and kept running in front of the gun. Fluffy, what's wrong? Were you hurt? Why? No, Fluffy, don't get dark. Huh? It's so scary, but I, I keep hanging in there. I just want to go home. So why won't Mama come? Does Mama hate me? Fluffy! Mama hates me. So she'll never come back for me. I'm just an unwanted child. Fluffy, that's not true. It's not... That's not... You're... You... I'm going to Mr. Policeman. I see, okay. I'll go with you. If I'm fine, I can go there myself. Fluffy, you shouldn't be all alone late at night. I'm a tough kid. I can make it my, on my own. 
Even if mama isn't there. Even if mama isn't there, I won't cry. Wait. Oh, shoot. No. My head feels like it's going to explode. Fluffy? He, he left on his own. No, Fluffy. Your mother didn't hate you. Well, I don't know. He basically abandoned him. It was you who lost faith in her. What have I been doing here? Wandering these ruins, looking for a man I don't know. I should go home. There's no point to this. Nothing. Nothing will change. Okay. Are you okay? Okay. I guess we just leave. Unless the crooked man really is here. Or still alive. Which I'm guessing he is. But okay. Let's just go. What the? Sounds like a woman's voice. Could be Fluffy's mother? So she didn't come for him. So she did come for him. That's good. I bet she and Fluffy passed each other by. Her voice is coming from the clinic side. I'll go check it out now. The clinic side? What is it? This side? It's not this side, is it? Clinic. I don't know what the clinic side is, so this isn't where the voice is coming from. I don't know. I don't freaking know. It's not any of these bathrooms. Oh. What the heck? Who who's that over there? Hey, who are you? What the Mom? What the heck? Why why is she here? Davy, why do you abandon me? That's not Mom. How can you be here? I hate hospitals. You're my family, yet you abandoned me. No! You were sick, Mom. So you left me. My own family. Couldn't stand me anymore. No! No, you're wrong. Whoa, 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 whoa. David, 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 who are you? My mom couldn't possibly be here. Why are you pretending to be her? It hurts, Davy. Just like it did then. Are you going to try and kill me again? Wow! I hurt so much, Davy. What the heck? Who are you? Why are you in my house? What did you do with my husband? Answer me. Mom, please stop. You keep saying things like that. Dad left a long time ago. Did you forget? Shut up, intruder. I don't know anyone like you. I'll call the police on you. Stop it. Don't tell me you're already going senile. Please, take a rest for today. I'm tired from work. Just tell me if I'm a bother. Shut up! Keep your mouth shut. Do you think I know you? Get out of here. Stop! What are you saying? I, did I do something wrong? Please tell me if I did something wrong. Are you teasing me? Because it's not funny. Please, Mom. Quiet! I'm not your mother. I don't know you. Get out! Enough. Whoa! Murderer! 
Somebody. Murderer! David. Hey, what are you doing? Hey, stop. Let go. You're trying to kill her? David! It appears to be a brain tumor. It's putting significant pressure on her brain. Sudden changes in behavior, violent action, and memory loss can be signs of brain disease. It's not your fault. Don't be distraught. In some cases, counseling to, to resolve friction in a family can uncover an illness. Maybe I shouldn't say this, but this kind of thing happens all the time. If we had noticed a little sooner. Back to the topic of your mother. She appears to be very weak. We'll have to postpone the operation for now. We've hospitalized her for the time being. And her condition will influence our decision. Hopefully, it won't be long. Please come by to see her often. Even if she doesn't seem to know you, she's family. No. We're not family anymore. Don't... Don't say we are. If I hadn't been stopped just like that, I would have. I would have never been... Have been forgiven for it. There really was hatred in me. And it's true. I've abandoned her in the hospital. She was my only family. My precious mother who cared for me. After my father left, and yet I. My wishes never came true. My dreams, love, and even family all go away. I can't have anything that's not crooked. What have I been searching for? I don't have to anymore. It's obvious now. There was only one way from the very beginning. Scene 3, Central Hospital Fluffy, has ended. Is this like the end of the game or no? Is this... Okay, I guess it's not. Okay, sorry for the long, longer video, but I thought we were getting close to the end. Whoa, 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 whoa. Dang it. David hasn't picked, answered a single call. What is he up to and where? Paul. What do we do? I knew, I knew he, we shouldn't have left David alone. Marion, get a hold of yourself. How can I, I be calm about this? David's so worn out from things with his mother and Shirley. He's even suffering over old wounds. I was always scared for him. Scared that he'd do something there was no turning back from. I suggested moving to get his mind clear, but that didn't help, now did it? It wasn't a bad idea, but it was a mistake for me to pick that place. Huh? Dang it, I'll call again. If he doesn't answer, we're calling the police. What do you mean? Why would the room be... Ugh, don't tell me ghost stories at a time like this. Always talking about how you see things, Anne. Oh, David? David, where are you? The abandoned hospital in Stafford? Why are you way over there? Listen, I'll find you. So wait for me. Don't so much as move a muscle. Don't come, please. Don't. Leave me alone. David. Hey, David! Ugh, he's in Stafford. I'd probably take about a day to get there on a motorcycle. Marion, I'm going to get David. I'm going with you, David. Or I'm going with you. David is my friend, too. I can't just ignore him at a time like this. All right, let's go. I'm trying to get to a stopping point, but I, like we're on so much dialogue. David's car. He's got to still be here. Come on, Marion. It's dark, so stay close behind me. Right. 
All right. Well, guys, that's going to be the end of this video. I know it was a longer video, but you know what what can I do? I did I was I really thought like that was the end and now we're uh, we're Paul and Marion. So, we're going to find out what is going on with David and what is he doing? Where is he? It seems like he's in a very dark place. I don't know what's going to happen in the next episode. I think the next episode is going to be the end of The Crooked Man. Like I said, guys, like, comment, and subscribe, and turn on post notifications. That way you, you don't miss any of my videos. Thank you guys so much for all the support y'all have been sending me. Like I said, right after this, I didn't know Resident Evil 8 was that much, but uh, I'm going to do it because I've heard it's a really great game. So, right after... I believe the next part is going to be the final thing of the Crooked Man, and then we will move on to Resident Evil 8. But like I said, have a great day, guys, and I will see y'all later.